So the first artist that we focus on in our In Focus series is Egon Schiele. And Egon Schiele is a really important Austrian artist. He was born in 1890 and passed away in 1918 already. So he didn't live very long, but became a very influential artist for art history and for modernism. Um, he was a protege of Gustav Klimt, the Jugendstil master in Vienna, but very soon developed his own very sub subjective and um, very expressive style, focusing on the the human body and on human emotions. One reason why it's particularly exciting to have Egon Schiele's works here at the Ashmolean is that although he has had large-scale exhibitions, most recently at the Fondation Louis Vuitton in Paris, he was also shown at the Royal Academy in London, he's not on permanent display in any museum in this country and therefore it's really exciting that we have these works here and it's a rare opportunity for our visitors to see his works. And one of my favorites is, is this one, Moa. It's a work from 1911. Moa was a dancer and it's, it's a work that really shows also the intimate uh, relationship between the, the, the artistic subject and the artist. It's a work that focuses on her movements and really shows his subjective expressionistic style. Basically, it shows what Egon Schiele then became famous for. This work is also a very typical work for Egon Schiele's practice. It focuses on the human body, on the naked human body. It's about sexuality and um, it's about a kind of raw human condition. And it shows why Egon Schiele was quite controversial at its time and why he sometimes got in trouble because his works were seen as obscene and um, they didn't really meet some moral expectations. The way that we show Egon Schiele's works is that we always have a pair of his works on display in the Leuven Gallery and this pair changes every four months and we also have a pair um, in our Western art storage and visitors who are interested in these works can come to our print room, they can see the works upon appointment.